Well, and how's everybody spending this beautiful Saturday? Coco McAvoy has been around town talking to folks to see how they're enjoying the weather. I'm really jealous of this assignment. <laughs> she joins us from the DeQuinder Cut. Coco. It's one of those days where it just feels beautiful outside. It puts you in a great mood. And trust me, people are taking advantage of this beautiful day all over Detroit and here in the DeQuinder Cut. Uh, $3. <laughs> Drifters Coffee set up shop along the cut on this picturesque day. When it's hot and sunny like this, people are thirsty, people are out, and they're looking uh, for something to drink. And looking for good ways to take in the sun, like walking and biking. I went to Florida in February, and I really, really had a shock when I came back. <laughs> so it's good, good to get back out again. Even struggling to fly a kite isn't enough to bring you down on a day like today because... It's, it's spring. It's happening. We made it. So people like Dante Bartleson traveled from Cincinnati to fish at the Riverwalk. Uh, river is actually nicer than ours, so <laughs> a lot nicer. The fishermen he met today, like six-year-old Xavier, are pretty nice too. Well, me and my grandma decided who was, was going to fish today. The plan was to catch perch and bluegill, rock bass. But so far, the fish aren't biting. So we have to keep on fishing till we catch a fish. With the sun shining and a warm breeze by the river walk, they aren't complaining. And like people all over Detroit, they're hoping for more days like today. And I got to tell you, too, you really learn new things when you're out and about like today. Six year old Xavier taught me what kind of bait I should use to fish, how to reel it in. And I'm told that next month is when the fish really start biting. In the DeQuinder Cut, I'm Coco McAvoy, Local 4.